Welcome to the Neurology Channel, a YouTube channel dedicated to all things neurology. We have a passion for sharing our knowledge and experience with others. On this channel, we cover a wide range of topics related to the brain and nervous system, including common neurological conditions, diagnostic tests, and treatment options. We also discuss the latest research and developments in the field of neurology. Whether you're a medical professional looking to stay up to date with the latest research, or a patient interested in learning more about the brain and how it works, the Neurology Channel has something for you. So, if you're interested in all things neurology, make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell to stay up to date with all of our latest videos. Thanks for stopping by and we can't wait to share more about the fascinating world of neurology with you. Hello and welcome to this video on Transverse Myelitis. Transverse myelitis is a rare neurological condition that affects the spinal cord, causing inflammation that can damage nerve fibers. In this video, we will discuss the symptoms and impacts of transverse myelitis, treatment options available, ways to cope with the condition, and the latest research in progress. The symptoms of transverse myelitis vary depending on the severity of the condition, but typically include back pain, muscle weakness, and loss of sensation in the legs, arms, or torso. Other symptoms may include bladder or bowel dysfunction, muscle spasms, and difficulty breathing. The impacts of transverse myelitis can be devastating, as it can cause long-term disability and reduced quality of life. Currently, there is no cure for transverse myelitis, but there are several treatments available to manage symptoms and prevent further damage. Treatment options may include high-dose corticosteroids to reduce inflammation, plasma exchange therapy, and immunosuppressive drugs to prevent the immune system from attacking the spinal cord. Coping with transverse myelitis can be challenging, both physically and emotionally. It's important to work with a healthcare professional to develop a treatment plan and manage symptoms effectively. Additionally, support groups and counseling can provide emotional support and help individuals with transverse myelitis cope with the impact of the condition on their daily lives. While there is still much to learn about transverse myelitis, researchers are making progress in understanding the condition and developing new treatments. Recent studies have explored the use of stem cells to repair damaged nerve fibers in the spinal cord, and ongoing clinical trials are investigating the effectiveness of new immunosuppressive drugs. In conclusion, transverse myelitis is a rare but serious condition that can have a significant impact on the lives of those affected by it. However, with the right treatment plan and support, individuals with transverse myelitis can manage their symptoms and maintain a good quality of life. Thank you for watching the Neurology Channel. We hope you found this video informative and useful. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comment section below. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel if you want to stay up to date with all of our latest videos. We post new content every week so make sure to check back often for more insights and information on all things neurology. If you're interested in learning more about a specific topic, let us know in the comments and we'll do our best to cover it in a future video. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.